Hello, I'm Dr. P. V. J. V. Head of School of Liberal Studies and Education. Let me put my views on the coach project of uh, Navarajna University. Yes, it's uh, for something we started now. Of course, it's happening right from, uh, I can say, the beginning of the university. But I can see the big transformation which is happening now. Transformation in terms of the very well planned program and that was a schedule in winter, so there is no interaction at all. So, as everybody knows, it's a social immersion. So here comes the, the, the fusion of the ideas of the, the mainly the students, of course, and is supported by the faculty. On an average, if I see from my school of SLSC. I can say 23 to 25 students getting into one project and that project is very relevant to the society. That's what I said. It's a social immersion program. Well planned. And since it's worked out, as I said, during the winter program, there is no other disturbance. They sit together, work out the project. And of course, wherever they have to get out the field, they get out. If you look at uh, the five projects which the School of Liberal Studies and Education have taken up, I can say the five projects. One project that of uh, Dr. Minashi has taken up that talks about the old age games which the country have right from uh, north to south and west to east. They have picked up all the programs which some of them have died down already, some of them which are running now. A historical searching is being done. And almost 150 games are being picked up, which some of them already they, they disintegrated, but brought it back again. And done a research on it. And very interestingly, not just the documents are brought in, they played it also. And there was a kind of what do you call scientific uh, explanation on that why this program, this particular game was there and why it is there and why it stopped us. So then coming to Dr. Jagra has taken up the uh, social issue, which is always a big problem in India, especially uh, not Burra is not an exception to that, the traffic problem. The amount of accidents which are taking place, the amount of deaths which are taken up. They have picked up that, picked up that issue with the traffic problems. The students who are going around, knowing the problem, going to the data of it, and they decided, yes, we will work out a program where we will stand across the, the, the district and uh, tell the people this is the problem. And we, at the age of in our 20s, we are really, really worried about this. And we'd like to the public, yes, please take care of all the traffic rules. Mainly the helmets. So there is a good exercise I could see, and they're collecting the data, the big document is done with closer association with the traffic policy. The other project which uh, journalism has taken up with, uh, I mean, with the support of Dr. Jigar, almost 20 plus students. That is the Marathi medium schools. And the students could find out that it's almost a, at a dying stage of these schools in, in Baroda. Only one school is there. And they are preparing a documentary on it because vernacular schools, which had a beginning almost 100 years back, more than 100 years back, why slowly, slowly it's seeing its death. So that will be a kind of uh, information for everyone what's happening because hardly I think anybody has gone into it it's a research program coming to Dr. Vaibhavi has taken now critical thinking through art education integrating the critical thinking through art again it's wonderful Dr. science because national policy for education is focusing a lot on uh, critical thinking which has to be a part of the school curriculum not the school curriculum, even in teacher education also. Again, a team of 23 worked out on that. And they're coming out with how critical thinking can be taught through art. 
and uh, different models are being made. I think that we will put up in the exhibition. That's one of the ones. The other one which uh, Dr. Walia has taken up, that's the traffic problem Baroda is facing. Traffic problem in uh, especially the residential, residential areas. The students went across, they collected the data, they spoke to the people over there, spoke to the society people, and they are working out some solutions. First of all, appraising the people over there, why the traffic, the car parking is not possible over there. Car, car parking will be the focus of why it's happening over there. They swap to the people and they are coming out with certain solutions where the societies can solve this issue. Even the people who are coming over there can solve this issue. But there are always disputes and quarrels with even go to the court. If it's working out, that's being worked out, of course. If it's reaching the people, I think this is a good, big advantage for the society.